been great. Well, Harry, um, for you, I guess, just obviously, first, when did you find out you were starting? And second, just what did it feel for you to just get out there and just kind of show what you could do a little bit more? I mean. Right. Um, well, first off, I found out I was starting about uh, 25 minutes for the game, 30 minutes. So pretty soon. Uh, I had an idea when I walked in the gym because I knew class might, may or may not play. So I just had my mind already ready. And I was ready regardless if I started or not. Um, and so it was uh, – Thankful for that. It was a great opportunity. And, uh, you know, I went out there today and just played hard. Uh, just keep my focus on what I've been focused on is rebounding and help me start and everything else followed behind it. So uh, just trying to do what I can to help us win. Hey, Harry. Uh, just wanted to get your thoughts on how you felt the spacing playing alongside Ben was. The coaching staff has talked about wanting to keep Ben on the floor next to a big, but right. obviously the challenges that come with that. Um, I think it's more of a challenge because we're just getting used to playing with each other. You know what I'm saying? It takes time. Only uh, we spoke about yesterday in practice. This is our, as of today, probably our 10th day together as a whole unit, second game. You know what I'm saying? So uh, I think we're getting good. I think we're getting better for, you know, as short as a period has been. And, um, you know, he's getting the rhythm of playing again. I am too, and along with all the other bigs, like I said, just getting it together. I think we're getting better with it. Uh, and I, I'm just learning and reading what he likes, what different reads he likes, uh, what situation he may want to ball screen, what he may not. So, you know, I'm just reading him, asking him what he likes, and uh, he's telling me when he need one, when he may not need one. So it's just figuring out each other and um, just building chemistry. Yep. Did, oh, Harry, sorry. Did it feel any different than the first game for you playing? Like, did it just kind of feel like, remind you of maybe – high school and NBA game, or did it just kind of feel like you don't have to do your business a little bit? Yeah, I mean, I felt good. Uh, like I said a couple of days ago, you know, it's like my first rodeo, you know what I'm saying? So just getting back in the swing of things. Uh, you know, every game I, I plan to get better. I feel better, win, getting better. And uh, it's all about confidence too, man. So just just building confidence each game and just, uh, you know, that's what it was my first couple of games in like two years. So for me, it's just just working through that. And I feel great. I've been working my body out hard in the summertime and now all in preseason. So uh, I'm excited to keep going and keep building. You just said, it, you know, that obviously has been a little bit of time since you've played in the NBA game. Right. You just spoke about that confidence. Does it take a little bit of time, you know, a few of these games, you know, getting some practices under your belt to get that confidence, you know, that you can be a productive NBA yeah, player definitely. again? Yeah, definitely. It comes with time. You know what I'm saying? The more you play and the more you keep preparing for it, the more film I watch, the more I keep uh, – you know, studying my opponent, that way I'm not figuring out who I'm playing. As soon as I get out there, I kind of got an advantage already. And uh, just focusing on myself and keeping my body strong, I'll keep uh, producing and keep getting better. So 